cleansing wipes. Um, people love them. I'm not keen on them myself. I very, very, very rarely use them. But they're so popular and people love them so much that I felt I really wanted to um, start again with cleansing wipes and test a load and see if I still didn't like them. And actually I was pleasantly surprised with quite a few of them. Um, the reason people like them so much is that they are so simple and quick and straightforward and um, that almost makes this video redundant in a way in that they are simple, quick and straightforward. Everyone knows how to use them. Um, you take them out of the packet, you rub it all over your face, it uh, takes all your makeup off and you toss it in the bin. That's sort of my problem with it to be honest. To me, um, cleansing wipes just don't replace a proper cleanse at all. They're incomparable. The condition of your skin after a proper cleanse and um, with, for example, a cream cleanser and a hot cloth and the feel of your skin after you've used a cleansing wipe, they're just incomparable. You don't feel fully clean. You have this sort of film of stuff over your face after a cleansing wipe that I think stops um, your skincare working as well. However, um, Oh, and the other thing I should say actually about cleansing wipes, the other reason I don't like them is that I'm sort of against things that are disposable when they don't need to be. I'm really aware of how much um, beauty, like every other part of commerce and manufacturing, contributes to environmental problems. But, uh, uh, and I'm, I'm not saying, you know, that I'm massively obsessed with it all the time, although it is something I'm aware of. But it just seems really frivolous to have this massive product category that is so popular um, that makes something disposable when it actually doesn't need to be. Um, if, like nappies say, cleansing wipes worked better than the real thing, like disposable nappies do, I could maybe see an argument for it. Um, but because a hot cloth, for example, can just get thrown in the washing machine and it's that big, um, over and over and over again, you can use it hundreds, thousands of times, um, I just think that's the more responsible option. However, I do live in the real world and I know that um, we all go out and get pissed sometimes or we're really tired or some people are unwell or they have little babies to look after and all of that. So I totally get why they are so popular. I just think they're not for all the time. So if you do roll into the house um, at three o'clock in the morning, definitely using a cleansing wipe is a damn sight better than doing nothing and sleeping in your makeup. I will give you that for sure. So um, I did test lots of cleansing wipes and I did find some were better than the others. As a general rule of thumb, I found them better if they didn't claim to be too moisturizing. Um, when they say they're moisturizing, it normally means that they leave this sort of gacky film on your skin which stops your skincare from sinking in and um, doesn't have any sort of beneficial effect. Your skin just feels a bit more comfortable. You're better off with a sort of um, neutral, simple wipe, like one by Simple Skincare, that doesn't really make any grand claims, just cleans off your makeup and then you can plonk some moisturizer over the top and you're good to go. Um, the other thing I found was um, wipes that had the kinds of ingredients in that you might find in proper skincare like serum and cream. I personally don't think those work. There's no way you could get ingredients to penetrate into the skin via a wipe. That's just crazy, I think. So you're much better keeping things really, really simple and straightforward. I also um, am a big fan of baby wipes. I found those work just as well in most cases. They took off mascara, they took off um, all my makeup. You could they, they tend to be bigger than cleansing wipes in size, so you tend to be able to get everything off with one wipe. I thought the Johnson's wipes were very, very good. In general, I just don't think you need to spend lots of money. In fact, I found lots of the more expensive ones made my eyes sting or my eyes water um, when I used them, which is another problem I have with wipes. But I don't, I don't want to seem like I'm really, really down on them. I know people love them, so hopefully from my selection, you'll find one that's right for you. Um, let me know what your favourites are in the comment section. Thanks.